What's up guys? We're in my home in Los Angeles, California. Today we're gonna to be talking about what it's like being born and raised in LA. Well, one thing was for certain growing up, I didn't want anything to do with the Hollywood entertainment scene. But a lot of friends, either who were child actors or uh, kids of famous actors or producers or directors, and a lot of them got really messed up, whether through substance abuse problems, drug addiction, temptation, accessibility. I started going out when I was like 15 years old, had my first fake ID when I was 15. So you got that temptation and you got that thrill to go out and be a part of the nightlife really, really early on. Believe it or not, in LA, I don't even go out. So how I stay focused, grounded, and disciplined is not being a part of the scene because frankly, I think it's kind of toxic. Um, there's a lot of posers, a lot of people flashing cash who don't really have it. Um, there's a lot of drugs, a lot of temptation, a lot of a lot of a lot of things. And what I try to do is, you know, stay focused on all the positive things. LA's probably got the most incredible lifestyle. You can't get better climate anywhere in the world. People are a little bit kooky. They're very self-absorbed. They're very shallow. And I don't know if it's gonna be a place I wanna raise my family, but for now, it's a great place to do business. The weather's amazing, lifestyle's great, tech is coming here, tech is popping off more than ever. And as long as you stay grounded, you stay focused, you don't get wrapped up in the party scene, you should be all right. Um, also, you need a car, because public transport absolutely sucks in LA or you're gonna be spending a lot of money on Uber or Lyfts because it's very, very fragmented. LA is kind of like a bunch of small cities inside of one giant city. So right now we're in downtown LA. My office is in West Hollywood, South Bay's the beach, Hollywood is over there. You know, it's all over the place. It's very, very, very spread out. So there's a lot of land and a lot of ground to cover when you do make your trip to LA. If you come see me or come visit Hollywood.